Hello there everyone, welcome back to the Gummy Yoshi channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do my warm-up course so that you can aim very well during your games and trying to hit more headshots and just get more kills overall. So I usually start off in the training practice area right over here with these bots. And as you can see, my last score was 27. You can get a score of 30 on this as there's 30 seconds, there's 30 bots, one per second. That would be the best score. Now, right in the morning, don't expect to get 27. Once you get onto Valorant, don't expect to be having your best aim, your end of the day aim where you're hitting all of your shots. No, that, that doesn't happen right as you get on. You need to warm it up and that's why we have this course. So you're going to start it off and your goal is going to just to get above, be just to get above 20. See, I'm already missing shots here. And you just want to get above that number because 20 is a very baseline number. It's, it's a good for starting off of the day. It's not too high, it's not too low, but it's still a good spot to be at. Now, by the end of this, you're going to be hitting probably 25s, 26s, 27s. You're going to be doing much higher numbers. So I just scored 26 there, but that's also because I've already run through this warm-up course one time. Now, you're going to want to run crew through this warm-up course about three to four times, as it's pretty short and it's pretty quick. Now, we're going to want to come over to this shooting range over here. You'll want to set it to 50 meters, and then you'll just want to try and tap fire this center target, and get as close to the middle as you can. Then, you'll want to move on to the bot target, and just tap fire trying to get all headshots. After you feel like you're good enough there, you're going to want to clear the target and bring it back to 5 meters. This is where we're going to start doing some recoil control. Now, you're going to want to start by aiming at the center, and your goal here is to get all of your bullets in this center circle. So you're going to want to drag your crosshair down, just like I showed in the uh, aim training video, and you're just going to want to try and keep all of your bullets there. This will be really good training for when you're in a game, and you might be in a close quarter situation where you come around a corner and there's another player right there. That way you can immediately start shooting them and not be missing all your shots. Now, that's good for now, but we'll come back to this on our second rotation through the warm-up. Now we're going to move, move over to these flying bots over here. Now these are really good for your aim because they're in the air and you get to flick to them quickly. So we'll start off with that one and we'll make our way from left to right. So we'll try and shoot all of them down and once we get all of them down, the first two are spawning back up. So it's a very good cycle that you can do. It just It's very good for improving your aim as it teaches you to aim very quickly and not wait for your target to be perfectly stiff. You want to try and get all of them down before they've reset. That's your goal here. You want none of them to be up. So now we keep walking this way, keep going around, do a little bit of a uh, raised play right here. And then we are back to our bot training course. And now we're just going to keep repeating this process until our aim feels pretty good. Now you can add in a few sniper spots here if you want to. You can set this target to 50 meters and just start by doing a little sniping on that. What I recommend doing is starting behind this archway and then moving out to the left and try and get it a target. Hit, hit the target right in the center or if you want to. Just try and hit the bot that's standing right next to the target. Now you'll want to scope in quickly and hit it. You don't want to take your time here, like I just did there. As in a game, the opponent's going to get a chance to shoot you before you've scoped in. So then just run through this course three or four times and you should be ready to go. If you did enjoy the video and it helped you understand how to warm up your aim in the mornings, then please consider leaving a like and subscribing as it would help me out greatly. I'll be coming out with lots more content just like this to help you out in Valorant and help you improve your game so you can be the best that you can be. Thank you for watching. I hope you have an amazing day and I will see you in the next one.